is up you guys, I'm Charrix and today I'm going to be doing a little Q&A. Now I uh, posted a video yesterday and in the video uh, I was just, I was doing like a little update but I also said I'm going to be doing a Q&A so if you had questions leave it in the comments. So I'm going to be going through some of the comments and seeing what you guys uh, want me to answer and uh, yeah without any further ado, let's begin. Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, step right up and get yourself a shirt. Get yourself a shirt at Beanie Boy Clothing. Link in the description. All right, what is your favorite video you have reacted to? Probably a video I did on Charmix 3, where I reacted to a um, Paula Dean YouTube poop, and it made me laugh so hard that I, I kind of lost, like I started like almost crying, and I had like I started having a mental breakdown. That's probably one of my favorite videos I've ever reacted to. So I think that's I think that's my answer to that question. All right, Q and A question: What happened to Cap and the bald bastards? He's left. Bell bastard, he's left. What? Uh, Cap is still at my parents' place. I gotta go grab him. But I don't really know where I'm gonna put him. I have nowhere to put him, like in the background. I couldn't put him anywhere. So even if I had him, I couldn't really put him anywhere. So uh, that kind of sucks. As far as the bald bastard, who knows what he's doing. Beanie Boy is finally playing with his beloved pink. <laughs> Um, it's not a question, but I, I think that's kind of funny. Will you ever make a live stream? I don't think so. Like, I wanted to do one when I moved out, and now that I am moved out, it's like, I don't know what I would live stream. Like, what would I play? What would I talk about? What would I do? It's not filtered, so I gotta be very careful with what I say. I don't know. Q&A for Charmix. Car... Carmex? What the frick? Uh, how happy was you, Mom and Dad, when you moved out? I don't know, but I think they were pretty happy just because now they're finally alone and <laughs> they don't have to worry about me in the basement anymore. So I think all in all, they're pretty happy. What is the most embarrassing moment you've experienced? I don't know. I've done a lot of stupid, embarrassing stuff. I think I think a recent one is that I was walking with my friend in the woods and I had to go to the washroom. So I look around to make sure no one was there. Um, my friend was like up ahead. So, you know, I go to the washroom on a tree, and then some guy runs right in front of me. <laughs> oh my goodness, I don't know if he saw me, like, with my schlong out, but, I mean, that was pretty embarrassing. That was, <laughs> that was, that was the most embarrassing thing I can think of at the moment. For the Q&A, how old is the one beanie? Like, the original one? The original one? Oh my goodness. Must be, like, five, six, seven years old. Somewhere around there. It's, it's it's an old beanie. This is not the original one, though. This is the one you can get at my merch store. Link in the description. <laughs> All right, are the upstairs neighbors annoying? Not really. It's just the noisy. That's the, the issue, I think. Like, they... I don't know what the, kid, what the kids are doing, but they just run around, like, the whole day. And sometimes, it sounds like they're just jumping on the spot. Just jumping, like, bum, 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 bum. On the spot for, like... A long time. I think that happened yesterday, and I was just watching TV. I'm like, what, what the frick are they doing? Because it just it kept going on and on and on. It's like, what are these ki what are these kids doing? So that is the the main issue. That the, it sounds like they're just running a track and field event up there all day long. Other than that, they're not they're not annoying. Like they're nice people. Tune, do you plan on taking a break anytime soon? Not really. Why did you start making videos and posting it on YouTube? I've always loved YouTube. I've always wanted to do YouTube videos ever since I was like extremely young. Like, I remember watching Ray William Johnson back in the day, and I remember when YouTube had the, um, when you used to rate videos by, like, five stars. I, I remember that when that was the thing. I've always wanted to do YouTube, so that's why. If you could only have one food for the rest of your life, what would it be? Or what do you, what would you want? That's a good question, because inevitably you'd get sick of the food. So it would have to be something that would keep you alive, that would have all the nutrients to keep you alive, you know? But I don't know what that is. Like, I know potatoes can keep you alive, because in the potato famine, people would just eat potatoes. So, maybe potatoes. Or something like, oh yeah, it has to be something that has all the nutrients to keep, to keep you going. So, I, I don't know what that would be. What are some YouTubers you watch when you're not making videos? I watch a lot of YouTubers. I've subscribed to a good few hundred people, I think. I watch, like, a lot of finance videos, like stock market stuff because i find that really interesting to me as well as like you know pewdiepie sometimes jacksepticeye sometimes a markiplier there's so many people like 
like even like Jeffrey Star sometimes I'll watch just because it's his life is so fascinating. It's hard not to be in, in enthralled by how much like the crazy lifestyle he lives. But like, there's so many YouTubers that I watch. Question: Chermix not simping or anything, but you are attractive. <laughs> so uh, why not get a girlfriend? I know there are plenty of girls that would want to be with you. Um, it's a good question. I think one, I don't lead, go outside that often. I'm very antisocial, and I think that definitely is a good reason for it because I just don't leave or don't don't talk to many people. I only have like two or three friends and I only talk to one friend on like a regular basis so I think that's a good reason also I don't really want to like you would have to go into like tinder or any of the other dating apps and I don't really want to do that and put myself out there on specifically apps so if I were to find someone it would have to be through a genuine day-to-day -day encounter which as I don't go out that often <laughs> Makes it kind of hard to have a genuine day-to-day -day encounter. So I hope that kind of explains it. Do you have a question? What are your thoughts on SML at the moment? I think they're really funny. I mean, now, not every episode is the best, but like I think the one I reacted to the other day was so funny. Like They're, they're very creative, and I, I, I really enjoy them. Do you have a question? What is your favorite type of zucchini? Um, hmm. The longer and the thicker, the better. <laughs> hey, um, why you why do you not really do any skits as much like we want more of the Charmix cinematic universe? The skits are really fun to make, however, I can't really yell or anything now because I'm downstairs in the basement and there's strangers upstairs. So that makes it a little bit difficult. And I don't know, I haven't really, I just have, I haven't been motivated to make any. Like whenever I do skits, it's normally I have I have motivation for it, something's inspired me to do it. And that's kind of what helps get me to do them. However, recently I haven't been that motivated, should I say. All right, uh, what activities do you do now uh, you moved out? Uh, the only activities I do now are just like going out and getting McDonald's and going for like walks. That's about it. Will you go back to your parents' house? Hopefully not. However, there's always a possibility, so I have, I've tried not to burn any bridges. You know, I've tried to keep a good relationship with them in case I actually have to go back to my parents' place. So, uh, who knows what the future holds, you know? Outside of YouTube, have you ever had a crush on somebody or had multiple crushes? What do you mean outside of YouTube? Like, saying that makes it sound as if I have crushes on people inside of YouTube. But I, I have had crushes on people outside of YouTube. I don't know, it's just weird that you'd phrase it outside of YouTube. Is your name Jeff? Uh, my name Jeff? Q&A, what is your favorite cartoon show growing up? Probably Scooby-Doo. I freaking love Scooby-Doo and Spongebob. Those two, I think, are my favorite. Will you ever get a cat or a dog? Maybe in the future. Definitely not here, because the upstairs neighbors have a dog and they don't really want any other, like, pets. But maybe in the future. I love cats and I love dogs. But I just don't like having to deal with, like, the... The taking care of them aspect. I love giving them affection and love. I just don't like having to walk them. Or, like, that's why I like cats more, I think. Just because you don't have to walk them. They can take care of themselves for the most part. When they want attention, they'll come to you. But, uh, maybe in the future. I don't know. Not, like, not right now. Will Beardless Charmix return? Yes, if the channel hits 2 million subscribers. I think I said that before. But if the channel hits 2 million subscribers, I will do Beardless Charmix. <laughs> We ain't hitting 2 million subscribers. <laughs> At least not any time this decade. SNG4 already said he doesn't mind reaction videos. If that is true, please send me proof on Twitter. Then I will continue doing uh, SNG4 reaction videos. Yo, why haven't you uploaded on Charmix Plays? You said you would upload uh, when you got your cable, and you got it, and there's no content over there. I know, I know. Oh my goodness. I know, I got the cable, so I can finally freaking make videos, but I just haven't. Maybe I'll set a goal. I'll set a goal for... Wait, what day is it today? Is it Wednesday? Or is it Thursday? I don't know. I'll try to create a video on that channel between today and next... I think it's Thursday today. So today and next Thursday, I will... I will try to make and upload a video on that channel. So that's gonna be my goal, okay? I'm gonna set that goal and hopefully I'll, I'll create one for you. Q&A, will you ever make a vlog channel? No. Like when I, when I make the vlogs that I have made, 
they are a pain in the butt to make. I like things to be a little bit cinematic if I do a vlog. So I like, like if you just go watch my vlogs, you'll see that I put a lot of detail and like, um, if I go put it like when I turn on the coffee maker, I have to get like a whole bunch of different camera angles of the way I'm, I'm putting coffee in it. And then I like, the, like I like things to be cinematic. And if I were to do that every day, It'd probably drive me crazy. I like your, uh, your seagull picture, though. Ah! If you could change one thing about YouTube, what would it be? That's a very difficult question, actually. I don't know. They've changed... Back in 2016, 2015, YouTube was a lot more of a, um, a wild west. And I, I, I miss those days where they weren't as strict. You could get away with doing a lot more. I, I think if, you, if they could just relax, you know, take a chill pill and go back to, like, 2015 where they just weren't really that restrictive on stuff. I think that would be I think that would be better, I think. Anyway, I'm going to end the video here. Thank you to everyone who asked questions. I know I couldn't get to everyone, but uh, I got I think I got to a decent amount of people, and I think some people had like relatively similar questions, so hopefully if you if I didn't get your question exactly, hopefully your question was kind of answered in this. And uh, thank you to everyone who, uh, you know, submitted their questions. And with that being said, I hope you guys like this. Make sure you check out the merch, link in the description. And with that being said, I'll see you guys next time. Boop.